Au. Now, is he going to come out of there now? Jump off. Would you freeze him? Just freeze it, close it. That's all I done. It's done. How do you know if it's going to come out or not? It's moving. It's That's moving. all I, I can see it now. I can see the leg moving. So I put the freezing underneath the skin, and the pressure of the fluid underneath the skin prevents the parasite from going in. It pushes it backwards. Looks like it's backing up there, mm -hmm. Andy. Well, I'm hoping it'll just drop off. It looks like it's trying to back off, isn't it? Mm. We have another shoulder, eh? Yeah, it's trying to back off. I can see it. There it comes. Ernie, you yeah. little master. See? That's Excellent. my technique. It worked. The wood tick is completely alive and intact. Voluntarily dropped off. done three like this on, on video mm -hmm. and, and it, there you go. okay there we go now see that I've got it well behind the stomach okay mm -hmm. okay now you can take that off okay. right near the head okay. yep. and okay you just pull the, the traction on it you start taking it <clears throat> see now the stomach can't the contacts can't come back you see. Mm -hmm. it's right around the mouth Mouth of the wood tick. And this is what I'm recommending for hunters. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, that's good to, yeah. good to know. Because this way they, you can't squeeze it, you see. Mm -hmm. Now with the traction on it, it just pulls itself pull it. up. Is he still alive? Yeah. These things are hard to kill. Oh, yeah, they are. Not if you use tweezers. There. He's completely off, see? Yeah. And he's untouched. Yeah. He's looking for more uh, blood. More blood. He's coming to get coming you. Coming here, coming your way. <laughs> <laughs> so.